Peachtree Audio tries to do things differently. Uh, the very first product we came out with was called the Deco. It was an integrated amplifier with digital inputs and a built-in digital analog converter. There was really nothing else like it on the market. And the whole reason behind it was the fact that the way we listen to music has changed. Uh, at the time, people were just transitioning over from CDs to digital downloads. Yet, the industry, the electronics industry, hadn't created an amplifier or receiver really capable of making those files sound good. Deep Blue comes from the same idea. How can we do wireless speakers better? How can we make a one-box wireless speaker that sounds better than anything else on the market? There is music on our phones, on our tablets, on our computers, yet we're listening to these small, wimpy speakers that can't reproduce the full range and dynamics of music. Deep Blue is the only wireless speaker that truly can. The first time I heard Deep Blue, our VP of production, Jim Spainauer, who's a co-founder of the company, came to Rocky Mountain Audio Fest. This was about two years ago. Now, for three days, I had been listening to $90,000 speakers, $5,000 amplifiers, just no holds barred, high fidelity audio systems. And on the final day, Jim comes in with Deep Blue and he starts streaming from his phone a track from Spotify. And the whole room just burst out laughing. We could not believe the amount of sound coming from this little box. And after we composed ourselves, we started to hear how good it was. The clarity, detail, the punch, dynamics, everything that you expect from a, a large hi-fi system was being produced by this thing that took up less than half a cubic foot. It was simply amazing. And once Jim told us that we could build this product and sell it for under $500, we were floored. We just lost our minds. So for the next month, I traveled around the country visiting some of our best dealers, showing them a prototype of Deep Blue. And their impression was the same as ours. They would ask me questions like, where's the subwoofer? Uh, it's gonna cost how much? It should cost more than that. Uh, they just couldn't believe the amount of sound coming from such a small box. We sold through the first container in a matter of days. Uh, dealers came on board with strong support. Customers came on board once the buzz started to build up. We got some great reviews from sites like the Wirecutter, CNET, uh, four and a half out of five stars average on Amazon. Uh, it, we, it was obviously a hit. Uh, Deep Blue was a big hit. Uh, so we had pre-orders for hundreds more and we put a deposit down to build another 900 pieces. After a couple of weeks, we started to get a little nervous because we hadn't heard from our factory. Uh, Jim, our VP of production, sent countless emails, made numerous phone calls and nothing. Uh, so we had this deposit down on the second container. Uh, we had pre-sold 800 out of the 900 units. Uh, finally, we heard back from the owner of the factory saying they couldn't fill our order uh, because they're out of business. So this was obviously a surprise to all of us, to them included. Uh, we decided to try to get the tooling and parts out of the factory but really we would have had an easier time convincing a lion to become vegetarian. There's just really no way for that to happen. Once a factory goes out of business, uh, everything inside is really gone. Uh, so we decided to start over. We could have perhaps retooled and done the same thing over again. We already knew we had a great product, but we decided to do it even better. So this new version of Deep Blue plays louder, goes lower, has greater clarity in the mids and highs, smoother treble response, more power, just really anything that we thought that we could tweak and make that much better would be worth it. Uh, we really didn't set any limits for ourselves to how good this product could be. We've also made Deep Blue easier to use than ever. We've improved its Bluetooth technology to include the aptX wireless codec which gives you lossless quality sound over Bluetooth. We've added an optical digital input, 
which allows you to hook up streamers like Apple TV or Sonos Connect. We've also included visual feedback on the top panel, so you can see exactly what base level you're set at and where your volume is. So overall, this is a higher performance, easier to use product than Deep Blue One, which was loved by so many people.